The situation is uh, very explosive. We condemn in the strongest possible terms this latest aggression against our people, and there is no justification whatsoever for assassinating any Palestinian by Israel, the occupying power. They have uh, assassinated uh, uh, a number of uh, Palestinians in the Gaza Strip. Our understanding that the number of uh, Palestinians killed in Gaza so far is nine, and the number is increasing, and there is a large number of uh, people injured. Uh, the uh, assassination was later on accompanied by uh, attacks from uh, the sea against the Gaza Strip from Israeli naval units, and uh, they are mobilizing a large number of forces, ground forces, with the possibility of moving in the Gaza Strip. Hello, gentlemen. We have shown for a very long time a lot of restraint in our response, but today we made it a point that uh, someone who is a mass murderer who has in the past and also was planning in the future to kill innocent Israeli civilians uh, would not continue to do that. For weeks and months, uh, I've been uh, calling the Security Council and the international community to stand up and condemn the uh, indiscriminate rocket fire against uh, Israel and Israeli civilians day in and day out.